Come in the car. You want to be in? No, 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 no. Oh. Hello, my name is Roche Shanice and welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna to do something a little different. Today, we're gonna to do something called Ask Me Anything. I let two of my daughters ask me 10 questions a piece. I don't know the questions often. <laughs> I don't know them ahead of time, so bear with me. But we're gonna do 10 questions a piece, starting now. How old were you when you had your first kiss? <laughs> 45. <laughs> the math not math. Yeah. <laughs> the math is not math. And, like, and you cannot play the bit. <laughs> um, how old are you in... <laughs> <laughs> in fifth <Jesus>. grade. <laughs> in fifth grade. How old are you? Ten. Are you ten? Then you just made ten double digits, mom. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. It was it was a very uh, kid friendly kiss. Innocent. <laughs> Next. Mm -hmm. Have you ever done drugs? Have I ever done drugs? Never. Do you believe in love at first sight? I believe in lust at first sight. <laughs> Are you speaking from experience? I mean, I'm just speaking from what I believe. Mm -hmm. Do you believe in like at first sight? That's, yes. not, that's not a question. Like, yes, definitely. Um, did having children stop you from accomplishing your goals? Yes. You guys <laughs> hindered my whole life. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it did definitely. It deters, yes. Definitely. I mean, but I love you all. <laughs> oh, no, that's crazy. <laughs> Do you have a favorite child? No, of course not. People say it depends on the day. So that means that depending on the day, everybody's the favorite? Somebody's yeah. a favorite every day? Yeah. So that means all my children are my favorite. I don't have Who's one. Who's your favorite today? <laughs> <laughs> Let me not say that. Everybody is my favorite today. <laughs> Safe answer. <laughs> have you ever been arrested? <laughs> I didn't think for a minute. It was that one time. Well, no, because I've never been placed under arrest. Placed place under about above arrest. Why are you playing the words like that? No, no, because I've never, I've, I've had handcuffs on me by the police, but I never <laughs> went to jail. <laughs> they took them off. It was a misunderstanding of misunderstandings. Mm, okay. So I had handcuffs on me. Wait, where are we going? Uh, hmm, that's trickled into the parenting, parenting worst-case scenario. Everything ends in a worst-case scenario, so y'all know. Mm -hmm. Like, no, I don't want you to ride your bike in the street because you can get hit by a car and die. Like, that's just, everything has to be worst-case scenario, and that's that definitely from um, my father. How old is too old to be living in um, your parents' house? I don't think that there's a particular age, but did you have something in mind? No, I was just wondering. Did you, were you plan on leaving? 18. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then if the plans change, do I hold you to 18 or mm -hmm. would I be wrong to hold you to 18? Yeah. Okay. No, I don't think that there's a, I think it's, it's, it depends on each child and it depends on each parent. So every parent is different, but for me, um, I don't have an age. <laughs> You're like, I don't have an age. All right, you're 32, you got to figure something out. <laughs> ain't no way. You ain't got no type of money to live by yourself. There's that's no the way. thing. That's, that's like some, some kids may need a push, a little urging. But I don't have like an age 
you know. Hey. <laughs> you sweat? <laughs> Whew, as long as they don't get tougher. What is the worst thing you ever did as a child? Oh. Stole somebody's money. <laughs> money is crazy, mom. Who money you steal? Somebody's money at school. <laughs> How much was it? Twenty dollars. That's not bad. No, that's crazy. Twenty dollars at school is a lot. I mean, I know some people. Who was you trying to go get? Stole hundred. I had nothing. I was trying to go get. First of all, whoever had a hundred dollars at school, they needed to be robbed. Who created that type of money at school? We we about to get. What mom was you gonna get? With $20, still that type of money. Well, I, I didn't have any money. I wasn't trying to get anything in particular. <laughs> it was wrong, and I'm sorry. <laughs> Turn over newly? Yes, I have. Okay. <laughs> if you could change one thing about your life, would it be and why? If I could change one thing about my life, what would it be and why? And I have to answer honestly. Mm -hmm. For sure. <laughs> Ooh. If it's too bad, we'll just bleep it out. <laughs> For sure. I would um, only have been married once and have all my children with my one husband. <laughs> <laughs> I've been thinking about that for a while. <laughs> that answer is not going to change. Okay. I had to drink off that one. <laughs> when did you know God was real? Probably, I, I knew it early, early, when I was a kid. Um, I didn't have one, I can't remember of one specific incident where I just feel like I've always just known. I've always had that feeling inside of me. That is real. Were your parents religious when you were younger? Yes, my, we went to church every Sunday. Every Sunday, every Wednesday for Bible study. And then we had Sunday morning and Sunday evening service. So we stayed in church. Were you in a choir? We didn't have a choir in the church that, that I grew up in. That was forbidden. Really? <laughs> Wait. Is that your dad's church? <laughs> <laughs> we don't that oh, I'm sorry. It's no, okay. it doesn't matter. It's, it is. It's, it's true. It's, you've been at that church for how long? See, that's <laughs> it's the type of church. Been a pastor? Oh. No. But it's they want us to be in the pews over there. <laughs> That's not what song is that? That wasn't no, even a song. That's a Star Spangled Banner, and that's a Christmas song. It's a whole bunch, a bunch of songs. But I did sing in a choir later. So yes, and then when I was an adult and married. Um, Soprano, but tenor, I was probably. Hey, I, I, was like, I, <laughs> I, I don't listen. I can carry a note with other people around yeah, me. Yeah, real quick, do a note. No, don't play. Oh. <laughs> what is one piece of advice you give to your younger son? Don't try to be like anybody else. Love you how you are. You're good. You're you're enough just like that. Then I wouldn't have had too many, so many losers in my life. <laughs> what do you believe is your purpose in life? And if you believe you have multiple purposes, can you list a few? Oh, I believe my purpose, one blow, is I want to share, I want to encourage, motivate, support, and I want to share God's love. Are you crying? No, oh. my eyes are <laughs> Share God's love. Are you still close with your um, childhood best friend? Yes. I mean, it's a little different now because we are, um, we live in different states. So that makes it a little bit different. But when we get together, it's like we've never missed a beat. What has motherhood taught you? Unconditional love. I need to elaborate. <laughs> Not patience. <laughs> oh. I'm glad you God didn't is, that. God is still you working. You. <laughs> no, you're lying about that. <laughs> God is still working with me on patience. Mm, he gonna work on you to the end about that patience. <laughs> I'm saying that patience is more so thin. I'm telling you. That's your constant battle. It's okay though. It's alright. You know what type of demon you find, so that's alright, it's okay. As soon as this is over. It's all good. <laughs> if you had to pick a song to best describe your life,
life would it be? A song that best describes my life. I'm a survivor. Anybody? Destiny's Child. I knew that, but I just wanted to make sure that they knew that too. <laughs> How did your mother treat you as a child? Good. I mean, it wasn't, I didn't, I have no complaints as far as like being treated well. She treated me good. It was, I had, I came from a divorce household, so it was a little bit different dynamic, but um, she treated me good. Is that, how do, how do I treat you as a mother? You good. <laughs> <laughs> wonder where this question stemmed from so you know it has some kind of basis there I want to know. Now she had patience did she? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like she had a little bit more. That's all right, just a little bit more. A mm. hint of a bit more. That's it. Mm. That's it. Mm. That's alright. But you're good. <laughs> you're doing good. Whitney? Uh, what is your favorite movie of all? My favorite movie of all? Mm -hmm. Well, you know, I love The Notebook. Why do you love that so much, Ma? Because I love a love story. But, like, that's not that's the, the best love story, story movie, movie. Like, Ma. Like, no, no offense to the creators. <laughs> I haven't seen it, but. What part? So, what? I mean, it just you shows. like what you like. Let's just say <laughs> that. So, that's perfectly fine. But it's just like, is that the. That's like, is it because it's a comfort movie or because it's just so amazing, the plot and everything? It's a love story. <laughs> it's a great love story. He, it's a comfort. They loved each other so much. And it just shows they loved each other so much in this life that they could not live this life without each other. So even in her moments of in and out of, you know, I'm not going to say reality because I don't know if that's, but mm -hmm. in her illness, even in those moments when she came back, she always knew him. And when she when she left, he left. We left together. I just thought that was beautiful. How old were you love. when you watched that? Oh, this is a, I've I've not watched it in my I've watched it recent, like in the last few years. I had never seen it before. Mm -hmm. Have you watched other like romantic love. movies? Yes. Before? Like they just must not have been that good. Have you seen Titanic? Yes, that was good. I'm not saying it wasn't. I know, but he, But you like that and he drowns? I mean, he freezes well, to I death in the water? Watch it. Oh. <laughs> I know there's some deep-rooted stuff in there. <laughs> deep -rooted no, but no, they're good. It's just, I, I love a love story. That's so. just a favorite. Yeah, that, right now, that's one I can come to at the, you know, right in the, at this moment. When do you feel is a good age for your kids today? And this, of course, you know, applies to your minors in Four. your household. 40. <laughs> 40. <laughs> I think you'll be already. real seasoned, real seasoned, and you've lived life. You, I can trust what your judgment. It's crazy, Ma. What, people, what if your kids don't live that long? They didn't miss nothing. <laughs> <laughs> what if they sold me? They, they sold me at seventeen. How do they know? What if they sold me at seventeen? I'm just saying. No, on a serious note, dating. Never really thought about it. I don't know. To each child is different, so maybe could be 16, could be 18. Go 18, you can do what you want. So maybe 16, depending on where we're at on the trust, meaning you know, following rules. And yeah. you know, if you're anything like me and how I was, you're not dating until 40. <laughs> Just so you know, right now, 40 is perfect. What did you want to be when you were growing up? A lawyer. That was real. <laughs> a lawyer. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. A lawyer. Yeah. Plans got what real. What do you want to be now? Um, an entrepreneur. Those were all the questions. But did you want oh, to be like a good. rapid fire? Like oh. look up some words real quick and just do like a few rapid fire. How about five rapid fires? Each or just together? No, together. Okay. Who was your first celebrity crush? Since yeah. I Washington. I know. I mean, <laughs> you know, you know, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, my bad. No, it's good. <laughs> <laughs> um, do you want to be buried or cremated? Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Had to go to death, huh? Um, Worst case scenario. Doesn't matter. 
If you got to choose your name, what would it be and why? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, my name is, I like my name, so now I, I, I right. like it. But, would you uh, have wanted to be like a... Would you have wanted to be a Shanice Roche instead of a Roger Shanice? That could have worked. <laughs> People would have pronounced it maybe better. <laughs> Yeah, Are we done with the question? Oh, no, no. <laughs> it's supposed to be rabbit. But. Do you think uh, love can happen a life for a lifetime? Can last a lifetime? I do. That's why I like love stories. Mm -hmm. You're I romantic? I'm not hopeless, I'm hopeful. I always say that. They would be like, no, it's just hopeless. I'm like, girl, shut up. Hey, uh, <laughs> I'm not hopeful romantic. You're like, girl, no. No, I'm hopeful. I've always been hopeful. I was uh -huh. hopeful. Do you I had it. Okay, this is not my question, but this is a question. Do you think you found the love that you've always wanted? Yes. <laughs> what is the best excuse for being late you've heard or used? The best excuse? Um... All right, okay, so so I want you to answer that. But you, we're not really late to stuff because of you, because you just yeah, programmed that to our head. Yeah, I can't but like, be late. For like missing, like deciding not to show up to play. It's not like leaving them high and dry but like but it but it's not a real because I'm, I'm gonna say this but it wouldn't be the truth right they right, just used it you just used it right. um uh i had uh explosive diarrhea <laughs> all over <laughs> all over my car on the oh way to coming explosive diarrhea <laughs> all over your car and wow Mom, that is ridiculous <laughs> if you say that i'll be like ooh. Well, you I mean, would you really question that if I told you that? And I could, I no, couldn't make it to your dinner because. <laughs> <laughs> Send me a picture. Oh, I'm about to die. My phone's going. My um. Send me a picture. Huh? My camera's about to die. Okay, that's it. That's that was it. But you get it. But yeah, that was it. My camera died, <laughs> so I have to film this ending on my phone. But thank you for watching. Like, comment. A question you might want to ask me and I may answer it because it's asked me anything if you're new and you like the content which is plenty of content subscribe share this video with anyone that you might think might enjoy it and have a great one God bless